cogido. Come on up here, honey. You sit with me. Get up there, honey. Go ahead. Go ahead. I want my eye back. Okay, here. Next, Aggies. I messed up my eye. Oh my God! Mommy's gonna eat with you too. Hello, everyone. Good morning. Welcome back to a new vlog today. Today is June third. I don't know what day of the week it is. We're gonna go swimming at the end. We are gonna go swimming. I don't know if it's Friday or Saturday. I think it's Friday, June 3rd, and as you can see, Levi and I are just sitting down to eat our breakfast. He's having strawberry waffles, eggs, and raspberries. He still needs some help feeding himself. Not feeding himself, but getting it on the fork. He has trouble, so that's why you always see me feeding him. I don't know, I think he's just lazy because when he tries, he, he does it, and he does just fine. He always asks me to do it because he's so, such a neat freak like that, like me, that when it falls off the fork or he makes a mess, like he's like done. He's like, all right, I need you to feed me because I don't want to deal with the mess. Anyhow, I'm having oatmeal with cinnamon, honey, and bananas. And I have raspberries. And you have raspberries, yes, sir. And the spring water. And what are you having? Uh, milk. Milk. Almond milk. Having a nice healthy breakfast before we go swimming. It's gonna be my first time swimming in like. Red truck is coming to go swimming with me. Red truck's coming too. Yeah. Red truck is my mom, in case you didn't know. Um, my first time swimming in like over a year. Here, babe, get a bite. Um, he went swimming the other day with my mom there at this in ground pool. It is a friend's and they're on vacation and they said we can go whenever we want. So. We're going. It's just gonna be me, my mom, and Levi today. That's not Robbie is doing out. a paint job on a trailer for a semi. I think I talked about that recently. He only has a couple more days to finish that, so that's what he's doing today. Um, yeah, we're gonna go swimming and have fun. Also, if you are new here, be sure to subscribe and click the bell to stay notified when we upload new videos. Bye, dummy. Bye, dummy, dummy. I'm coming over here. My name is Allison, and this is Levi. Say hi. I have to sneeze. <laughs> no, I'm Holy Levi Randa Bonnet. <laughs> he said his full name. You are Levi Van. He said his last name, too, but I'm not even going to say it because well, for safety I reasons, I guess. But we are going to That's finish our breakfast. Really hot. Sully is hot. He was outside and it's like 85 degrees and sunny and muggy, so it's a perfect day to go swimming. He wants to show you his truck. Come sit down. We gotta hurry up. Grandma wants us to hurry so we can come swim. So we're gonna finish our breakfast, um, get our swimsuits and everything, and walk out the door and head to the house to go swim. <laughs> you excited? 
Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are we here? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love when he gets like that. We have arrived at the pool. It was kind of a long drive to me. I don't know. It was like 25 minutes. Man, more like 30. Um, my mom literally just pulled up right before us. The pool is in there. We're going to get out and go over there, right? Get out. Let's go. Okay. Oh, bless you. Bless, babe. Whoa. You excited? You ready to get your suit on? Don't put any rocks in the pool, okay? No rocks in the pool. Why? Because we don't put rocks in the pool. Why? Ooh, is it warm? Mm -hmm. I got a two-piece swimming suit on. I don't, yeah, I don't feel very confident in it because of my belly, but I got this little cover-up on. Yeah, my butt's getting too big. My bottoms don't fit in there. Not happy about that at all. Belly. Let's get your swimming suit on, honey. Alright, we stopped swimming for a moment to take a little snack break. I haven't gotten my hair wet because um, I did a hair treatment last night and it feels so smooth and so good and I'm afraid the chlorine would make it feel like poop again. And I know that sounds silly. I'm probably going to end up just not caring and doing another treatment later, but I didn't know I was swimming today otherwise I probably wouldn't have done that. But. I'm having some Funyuns. And I have some Doritos. Levi's having some Doritos. And I'm having some peanuts. Some peanuts and some barbecue chips. And we have some watermelon. Some yogurt. Some applesauce. Some cheese sticks. <laughs> what did you see? What did Grandma pull out? Some Guess popsicles? Scissors. Yeah. I'm sure we could get one open. And a banana in there as well that I brought for Levi. But he's munching some chips right now. So he's got apple juice in this little thing right here. It's keeping it nice and cold. I made a weird noise. So we're going to have a little snack. And then we're going to hop back in the pool, huh?
We just got home a few minutes ago. I feel so drained. My body is like. It's raining outside. No, it's not raining. I said I feel drained. Um, you you rain do. I'm so drained right now. Like I could fall asleep just sitting here. I don't know if it's just from being pregnant and being out in the heat and swimming and just like exerting a lot of energy, which you do easier when you're pregnant, or if it's just from the you heat know, in general. You should have brought so much this summer. I know. I should have brought Sully. If we go Sunday, we're going to take him. Um, and, and, and Red Drop should take Miley And she too. should take Miley. Yep. I think we decided we might do that. Oh. Yeah. Definitely had a blast though. I just feel so. I had a blast too. You had a blast too? Yeah. Tell him what you did. I had a blast. He had a blast. Doing what? Oh, my, my ranger's not wrinkling anymore. Your fingers aren't wrinkling anymore? Wow. What? what? I see. They're, They're not. not wrinkly. They're not wrinkly anymore. No. You know how when you're in the water for a long time, your fingers get all pruney or wrinkly? His fingers aren't wrinkly anymore. He's happy about that. <laughs> yeah, then the stop here. Yeah, they're better now, huh? Then the stop here and go down. Yep, when we got home, they went down. That's what he said. Anyhow, had a good time for a few hours. Swam, hung out to sneeze. And we are home now in our nice air conditioned house. It is 90 degrees out, so it was a good day to go swimming, but uh, it felt so good when we got inside. Levi said, oh, it's nice and cold in here. I'm like, oh my gosh, yeah it is. Um, so I don't really know what our plan for the rest of the day is. Probably just hanging out inside. I have his, I don't even want to say it, his water, S-L-I-D-E. My water slide! <laughs> Is that my water slide? Yeah, I did. I have that. My water slide. In the backyard. We put it out there yesterday because it was hot. So maybe again, maybe today if he wants to go out there and do that, we will. But for now, we're relaxing, right? So, I already want some minutes so I don't throw on my water slide thin. <laughs> yeah, but we're relaxing for a little bit. Mommy is so tired. I need to get some energy, chug some more water. I need some this is like my third water bottle today. Some more apple juice. You need some so apple I juice? Then, so I can run some water. Okay. And I need to eat something. And then maybe we'll go back. O U T S I D E. I really don't want to, but if he wants to, we will. We'll see. Can you carry that one for me, or is it too heavy? Too heavy. Okay, put that one down here. You get this one. So we got to repaint this one, too. Get that one for I, me. No. You got it? You're sure? Here, you get this small one. Nah. You get this one for me. It's not wet anymore. Not wet? No, it's not wet. It's dry, baby. Oh. We gotta repaint it. We are going to the very backyard back here. I'm going to spray paint this wooden thing. It's just like a wooden thing that goes on the wall. It's got two little knobs you can hang stuff on. A little heart and this one has two hearts and these four knobs that go in there you can hang stuff on them grab that babe um, and I'm gonna paint them white for baby girls room I don't know my mom got them from a sale and just decided to get them for me and I wasn't sure what I was gonna do with them so we're gonna make them white and put them in baby's, baby girl's room and hang uh, whatever on their bows, headbands, whatever. So, okay, we're gonna do, we'll do them on this pallet of wood. Alrighty, got some ultimate high gloss spray paint. Um, the spray paint I used on that yesterday kind of sucked and it looks really bad. So hopefully I can bring it back to looking good. And the spray paint did not stick on these for some reason. So we got a different kind. And we're gonna make these look prettier. So they can go in whose room? Yeah. These wood. Whose room are these gonna go in? Uh, mine. No. 
Whose yeah. room? Uh, sister's room. Sister's room. Yes, honey. All right, let's do it. So we did this one. I don't know. It doesn't look good to me for some reason. It looks all right in the camera, but up close it's like... And this one not wins yet. No, we didn't do that one yet. It's a little bit harder than I thought. I mean, it's easy to spray it on, but for some reason it's not working with these knobs. I'm getting all messy. It's kind of like dripping off of them and like not sticking very well. I don't know. I know it doesn't matter that much. It's just a little fun project. Dang it. I can bring this one back there. Mommy's making a mess on herself. And I know this is not going to come off. Oh, it's all under my nail. I got to go wash my hands. All right. Well, there's that one. I mean, Looks decent. I can not bad. I that one over there. I just went and washed my hands best I could. Pretty much got it all off my skin for the most part. There's like white splatter on my nails which kind of looks cool if you can see it no you can't see it it kind of looks cool but um i'm repainting my nails tonight anyways for the fourth of july tomorrow because they're already chipping so i think the nail polish remover will probably take all that off so here's what we ended up with that one's finished this one looks pretty good now that it's like kind of drying a little bit this one I don't know. I had some trouble with it. I did the best that I could on top and everything. <gasps> oh, I thought there was something on there. Those are holes. Ooh, it needs more. It needs some more. I thought there was like dirt stuck to the paint, but it looks like there are little tiny holes on top. Mm, I need more paint on there and I really don't want to spray anymore. That's all I'm doing. I'm gonna let that dry probably overnight. <clears throat> Come get it tomorrow. Maybe it'll need a second coat. I don't know. That had two coats, so I think that's good. But <sighs> it's probably not good, safe for me to be breathing in. Shut that. I'm just gonna leave it all right here on these wood pallets. Levi's over there waiting for me. So, like I said, those are for baby girl's room. Here's Levi's room. I don't know if I've shown it in a long time. Here's baby girl's room. I kind of, oops, kind of started working on it a little. Not really, I just got some furniture in here. I did hang this. Um, these are her bows. I got these off of Etsy. I got these off of someone who makes bows on Etsy. Um, I think these colors are zero to three months. And then these are three to six or three to a year. I don't know. Um, I can't really remember. Um, I'm out of breath. I picked these colors for zero to three months because it's gonna be October, Thanksgiving, and Christmas time um, in those few first months that she's born. So I think these colors will go well with the clothes she's gonna wear on holidays and stuff. And just, I thought these colors were pretty. I plan to order so many more. They're so cute, so soft, comfortable. Um, and I'm going to have her name painted on here, of course. I'm not going to tell you what it is yet. In my previous video, I said to comment and give your name guesses for baby girl's name, starting with the letter S. My comments were on for, I don't know, maybe 15 minutes. I got a few guesses. And then YouTube shut my comments off. Just so you guys know, I'm not the one turning my comments off. YouTube takes it upon themselves to do that in order to protect minors. I don't agree with it at all. I don't, I mean, I don't, it just doesn't make sense to me how comments being turned off protect my toddler. They don't, 
protect, it doesn't protect anything, but I don't know, the countless emails I've sent, they always reply the same thing. So I don't get to pick and choose when my comments are turned on. Anyhow, I've got this, I cleaned it off and put the shelves in. Dang it, I put the shelf backwards. This wood should be on the other side and that was hard to get in because it was, dang it, I wish I would have realized that. Yeah, whatever. So for now I've got these little shelves in here. And then, I don't, this obviously isn't where everything's gonna go. I don't know where I'm gonna have the crib. Maybe centered right here. Obviously I'm gonna have curtains, so the light won't be shining in, um, blasting in her face in the mornings. But of course for a while she is going to be bedside in a bassinet type thing like I did with Levi until I ended up sharing my bed with him which I'm still doing and I promise I'm getting him out of my bed and into his bed before the baby comes. That is the goal. I haven't even tried so that is the only reason he's not in his bed because I know I could get him comfortable and happy in his own bed within a week. I just had to put it into action and it's my fault that I haven't done it so I just wanted to point that out. He will be in his own bed within the next few months before baby girl comes. Um, anyways, and then I've got this little thing. It just has two drawers, just more storage. I don't know if I'm gonna put like diapers and stuff in there or if I'm gonna use this little utility cart. It's got currently got these little marble baskets. This has been in my room for like ever. I got this book when I was pregnant with Levi. To be honest, I never read it. Kinda wish I would've what to expect the first year. Maybe I'll read it again just to, or maybe I'll read it um, just for fun, just to refresh my memory. And then this is an ultrasound. I don't know if my like address or something is on there, so I'm flipping it over. Look at these little turbans. I think that's what they're called. Oh my gosh. These are so cute. I cannot wait to put these on her head. I got mustard yellow, this like dusty pink, and gray, I'm going to order more. These are also off someone on Etsy. So right now I've just got that cart, those drawers, these shelves, and these cubicles are kind of like bunched up over here. Um, I'm going to put some, I think I'm gonna use some for Levi's playroom downstairs. I need Robbie's help. I'm really not sure even how to put them together. Um, Oh, I also hung some clothes up. This is literally all she has right now. And these are just like little gifts from people when they found out I was pregnant. This is literally all I have for her right now are these few onesies. Um, I have this boppy up here from when I was pregnant with Levi. I'm gonna just change the cover. I know I don't need to, but I can't help but want everything to be girly, you know what I mean? Got these pink hangers. Um, I need to take these pink buckets out of here and take these to the basement. Take that screen to the basement. This is pack and play from Levi. It's pretty much just neutral colors. So I'm keeping that for baby girl because Levi literally never even used it. But I'm gonna put like three, four, five, I don't know, whatever I, whatever I can fit in here. Kind of like make a little storage organization unit. Either standing or like something in the closet. Um, for storage and organization. So I need Robbie's help with these cubicles. Um, like I said, not all of them are gonna stay in here, I don't think. I'm gonna put some in the basement, or not the basement, um, the Levi's playroom. So yeah, I don't have a lot of stuff for baby girl right now, like nothing at all. I don't have a crib. I don't have a changing table. I really don't have any clothes. Um, I don't have a, I don't have anything right now, literally nothing. Um, I do plan to have a baby shower. I don't know if some people look down upon that if you have one for your second kid, but I say when it's your life and your world, not your world, but okay, just your life, you can do literally whatever you want. And Levi is three and he's a boy, so I'd like to have a baby shower for a little girl. It's just, it's so different and so I am having a baby shower, probably, I don't know, maybe September. 
Baby Girls do November 5th. So I'll probably have one in September. So that way it's not like cold out yet, but not like hot. Um, so that's the plan. Don't have literally anything, like I said, but I did start working on our nursery just for fun. Like I said, this isn't really where everything's gonna go. Maybe her crib will go in this corner, or maybe it's just gonna go straight on this wall. Like I said, I have no clue, but I'm happy just to have some storage and organization items in here. And this is just so cute. I can't wait to paint her name on here once we're for sure set, even though we are for sure set. I guess once I just tell everybody and um, once we decide on a middle name and all that. So if you do want to make guesses, I don't know if the comments will be on for this, but you can always go message me on Instagram, which a few people did. If you don't follow me on Instagram, this is my username on there. Um, feel free to go take guesses on the name. Her name starts with an S, as in so. Um, we're choosing between three middle names, kind of I guess two now, because Robbie ruled one of them out, but one of the middle names starts with an R, one of the middle names starts with an E, and one starts with another S. And um, the S middle name is my favorite, so her initials would be SS. H S S, which is kind of cool. It really doesn't matter, but um, her name begins with an S. So feel free to message me on Instagram and tell me what you think it is, because it's fun for me to hear people's um, opinions. I've got a few different ones. Nobody guessed the name right yet. I will say that, even though if you do guess it right, I'm not going to tell you. Um, I am genuinely so tired right now. It's a little bit later from the last time I had the camera in my hand, maybe like an hour or two later, I kind of fell asleep on the couch for like, I don't know, maybe an hour. I didn't really fall asleep because Levi wakes me up every couple minutes by telling me he needs something or this or that. And I literally never fall asleep during the day. One, because I'm not able because of this little turd. But um, I just, I never do that. And I just like dozed off on the couch for a little bit. I don't know, I think the sun got to me. As you can see, my face is a little bit red. It's probably hard to tell because I'm still pretty pale, but my face got some sun. Um, I'm just like, I don't know, I'm drained. I'm so tired. Ravi's on his way home from work and I'm like, holy crap, I am way too tired to cook dinner right now. Normally, every single day. Um, I've got dinner ready. What are you doing? Reaching for me. I've got dinner ready, like hot and literally just ready the moment he walks in the door. But I'm so tired, so I just ordered pizza for him and I. I'm cooking for Levi. Just literally, it's just macaroni. Nothing special or healthy. Um, just some macaroni and pizza should be here soon. And I'm calling it a night. I'm so tired. I cannot believe how tired I am. Wow. I haven't felt this tired. I haven't felt this tired yet in a long time. But I'm going to end the vlog. Daddy's here. I think I hear a scar. I'm going to end the vlog. Be sure to subscribe. Daddy's here. Yeah, go look out the window. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already and stay tuned in for our future videos. Peace.